Morning. Morning. Okay, Miharam, uh, plenty talk talk to Sangumama. Okay? So, we like talk to um, how do we how do we overcome the enemy's strategies? Me like talk talk one thing, me Miharam, plenty talk talk with them. Inshallah, pray for them, you plenty talk talk with Sangumama, I'm going to be, but talk to them, you know, I'm going to play, and I'm going to come along. Now me like talk talk like you help me you play long. How sad but me play you win him. Talk talk for Sanguma now. Pray for Sanguma inside long or community play you mean or churches play you mean inside a life bringing me one one. Okay. A number of years ago, I went to a village in Papua New Guinea. Some year ago, please me go along one for a place of Papua New Guinea. And people told me before I went there, there's a a very scary person there. I'm only talking about like one blue man, the place here, and man, no good now. And me blue, I'm gonna say, pray it long. And I thought, has he got a big sword? And then me think, you know, this is a man, and me get one blue big blue binder, blue pipe, kill him all man. Has he got a big club? Oh, I'm gonna one blue big stick, bro, do I blue pipe him all man? Is he a, a seven foot tall giant? <coughs> and me, seven foot tall, also, and then a giant. Oh. And everyone was scared of this this man. I'm gonna man, he prayed with this little man. And uh, I went to the village. And me go to this little place. And I was waiting for this scary man. Then we went to look at this little man or man story, little man, and said, man, go pray to him, old man, or like kill him, old man. Or. And they said, here he comes. Now old man is talking, this little man him come. And I turned around. Then we turned him. Lick, lick man. Then we look at him, old lick, lick man, so lick, lick man. <laughs> lick, lick old man. I am lapun man. And uh, I said, I thought, why? Why are people scared of this man? And they're all, oh, it's very scary, man. They were scared of him because he had, uh, he used sorcery. Okay, and so everybody in the community was afraid of this lick, lick, Ah, Lapun Man. And I thought, why? He, he's not that scary. But people were afraid because of the power they believed he had. A man very prayed because only only prayed with this love. How are we this man in God Lomen? Okay, so today I want to talk about that power and how, as Christians, we can't give in to fear. Now, today when we talk to about this love. This is a power. No, yeah. How about you, me Christian? You know, can, you me learn, and this is a fact. This is something you hold in life, like you me. Okay, I want to tell you a story from the Second World War. Me like walking one really story can from World War Two. And this is uh, in in uh, Germany and England. This is something. This is a story I'm coming from Germany and England. And there were all these ships going to England to bring uh, from England to bring supplies to the army. Now this is ship you lose in England, now you go long bring him kai kai or something long or man is still a fight or army still a fight. Because they were fighting against Hitler. Because only fight against him this man and name long and Hitler and man Germany. <laughs> okay, but as the ships were going through the ocean, the German submarines were sinking them. Bang, gone. <laughs> Damn, or ship long England is him or kai kai or something will fight they come. Uh, Hitler and Salim all, all submarines blow him come now, all shooting bomb in Guantanamo, sink him all to get a ship blow this blow, all uh, you know, English. And this was a big problem because the soldiers fighting in Europe didn't have supplies. This was a big problem because all soldiers fighting in Europe are now sort of like now. And no, no bullets and guns. No, you know, all like that's all. Or something like that's sort now because ship here uh, or submarine is sinking all. And it looked like Germany would win the war. You look at them. Our Germany will win the war now. Okay, and so they they heard from the German submarines a code, but they couldn't work out the code. Like a code, like um, take a message and translate it, to make it impossible to understand. Our Germany used in one or English or England. 
Ol hari mo sa mo jam ni using on rokan special code blong. Tok tok namin lang all yet na sa online England. Ol na sa one kain meaning blong is the code. Ol mas find him out so that ol can find him road but stop him mo submarine by nena blong. Suti mo sip blong ol England. So if they could work out the the code was there, they if they could work out this code, they would know where the submarines were and they could go around them or destroy them. <coughs> Suppose uh, all um, army belong England or Sabi long, this is a code, all you can try him long or talk Sabi long or sip long or can abruise him or submarine long, um, all uh, German or all you can blow him or this is a submarine. Yeah, but they couldn't figure it out. So all in the Sabi long, how long figure out this is a code where all you use him, number secret code, code all you use him long, uh, blow him or sip long, um, England. It was called the Enigma Code. This number this uh, code em, uh, igni Enigma. Enigma code. Enigma code. And it was a, a, a big problem that they couldn't figure out this code. No, a big problem because all, um, all, all, all England in the novel of him out, meaning now, uh, reading this uh, code long all uh, Germany, or use him long, blow him all, ship long all uh, England, or bring him supply in a gun, or get something, kai kai, or get something called Europe, or fight. Okay, but they they started working on the code. So all you know, lose, all you know, give up. All time, look, find him, find him, way block and save it long. This is the code. And they made a big machine. Now all you make you want the big machine. And one day, this big machine discovered the meaning of the and code. One the day, instead of this is a big machine, all you walk him, and we now find him out meaning of this is code. And they they listened to the code and they put it through the machine and it told them where the submarines would be. <laughs> So only put him yellow this blah. Look, 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 I put him yellow this on machine. Now, um, this on machine, and me read him all code. Now I'm talking all over him, how about the submarine is up under the water, so see, blow, can abrus him. Okay, so as soon as they knew the code, they could go and destroy the submarines. Now only, sorry, one him, how about the submarine is up. I'll save the road blow, destroy him all the submarine under the water. Okay, and they were no longer afraid. Now only no more afraid. Because they had the power to understand uh, what the enemy was doing. Now, only got power, block and save, or got strong, block and machine help him or not save, or only more plan or tactic away. Enemy use him, not destroy him or ship long one. Okay, so if we have, if we know the plans of the enemy, we don't have to be afraid. Suppose we save long or plan, we build up, we build up, we not afraid. We can prepare ourselves. We build and ready, we build yet. We can be ready for the enemy. You make him ready to bring him enemy. Okay, so let's talk about what the enemy's plans are and how we can overcome. Now, you may talk to him like long. One more plan, long enemy, and how about you may win him all. Okay, so. Lost start Bible. Makes sense. Any Bible in Genesis? Lost start. Okay. The book start. Book start. Uh, giving big la pizza. Remember giving big la pizza. Got heaven. The ground. What him hap? God is stop. Heaven is God is stop or heaven. God is stop. Where am still heaven? God is stop or heaven. One him hap man Mary stop. Ground, okay. Ground. Man Mary, okay. God he God he put him two plus D Y. One plus D Y. Three belong. Save. Three belong save. Good plan and no good. Do what you say. Do what you say. Okay, narrow pillar tree. No, narrow pillar D Y. D Y belong life. Okay, D Y belong life. That's all. Two plus D Y or plenty D Y. Plenty D Y. Okay, I'll get a kind kind D Y here. Okay, I'll get a kind kind. Mango, banana. Breadfruit, okay. I'll get a kind kind uh, DY. Uh, abus? Yeah, okay. Uh, big big, big pla, elephant, abus. Yeah. Okay, big pla. Uh, lick lick. Uh, K. 
cat, uh, pussy, pussy, pussy. <laughs> um, all, all got a, all get a kind, um, kind, kind uh, abuse, okay? Garden belong Eden. Okay. I mean, look this one out. God, he walk about low man Mary, okay? Good plan? Okay, God, come down. Now walk about low man Mary. Okay. This le garden, God, he make him this le garden. Good plan. I'll get us something good plan. Okay. Okay. Something happens in the garden, doesn't it? Okay, what happens in the garden? What is in the garden? Okay. Snakey come. Snake here. Tree belong, uh, tree belong. Sorry. Snakey come. Okay, snake. And God said, you can have, you can eat from every tree. Any tree you like, except this one. God, he make him law. I'll get a tree. You kai kai him. Uh, mas itambu? No ken kai kai. No ken kai kai displa tree, okay? What did that tree represent? This is the way you make one of something. Sabe. This tree means you can have knowledge without God. You can have wisdom and life without God. Okay? If you want to stay with God, you can have life. God gives you life. But if, if you go to this tree, that represents life apart from God. You can go here and say, I want my own life. I don't want God. And I can have that tree, but if I do that, I'm separated from God, I will die. That's what God said. Okay, makes sense? Okay, so uh, snake come. Remember, we talked the first day about what does the snake do? God said, if you eat of this tree, you will die. What does the snake say? Did God say? Remember, God, suppose he puts the question. What did God really say? You won't die. And then he lies. So he says, come and eat the fruit. It's really good to have your own life apart from God. You don't need God. In fact, God is doing you a bad thing because he's keeping you from this tree. This tree is a good tree. You won't die. You'll get knowledge. God is holding back the best from you. You can have your own life. You don't need God. You will have your own life and wisdom. It's good to, it's good to eat. It will give you knowledge and wisdom. You can have that apart from God. So, Mad Mary, Kaim, or this the tree. Something happens. What happens as soon as they eat from that tree? When does something come up? Separate from God comes down and says, Where are you? The other night, our brother said, Where are you? Okay, so something happens. When you eat from this tree, you can't eat from this tree anymore. You can only eat from the life, you can only have the life of God. If you are living in dependence upon God. You can't have an independent life. You can't have life without God. You can't have this tree, the light, the tree belong, uh, belong life. You can't have that tree if you have your own life. So as soon as you eat from this tree, you cannot eat from this tree. You can't have the presence of God, you can't have fellowship with God if you choose your own life apart from God. Is it okay? And that's the first temptation. Every temptation really is, I will have my own life, I don't need God. 
But if you say that, you cut yourself off from the life of God. Human beings, man, Mary, are created to live in the presence of God. With God in our heart. Okay? All good. Make sense? I'm clear. Yes. Okay, so, uh, God says to them, you've eaten the tree, you must go outside the garden. You are under the judgment of God. Life will be hard. Uh, man must work. Mary must uh, get pain with children. And um, so life becomes hard. You know what it's like? It's like on the river. When you go up the river, you have to have um, boatmen. What happens when the fuel runs out? You start to go backwards. Life in a world where you're cut off from God is like going against the current. Life's hard. I have with my with my garden. It's it's hard. With my family, it's hard. With my children, it's hard. Life is hard. When you're in a world when you're going against the tide. And because we've been cut off from the life of God, life in this world is hard. It's pushing against the tide. So we have to keep, work hard, work hard. Pushing against the current. And if we stop, we drift. We go backwards. And the whole world is going backwards. Because we're cut off from the life of God. Okay, the strategy of the enemy was to say, like in Mark chapter 1, when, when God says to Jesus, you are my son whom I love, with you I'm well pleased, what does the enemy say? Suppose. Suppose you are the son. If he brings a question mark on your identity. Are you really the children of God? Maybe you're not the children of God. So the enemy brings a question mark. We have to be secure in your identity. And in the New Testament, the identity comes through the cross. The blood of Jesus cleanses us from our sin. We are reconciled to the Father. We come back into the house. Back into the Father's house. We are part of the Father's house. Because of what Jesus has done. Okay? All good. Okay. <coughs> Now, um, so we are cut off from the life of God. This tree is no longer available to us. <coughs> and that's sad. That's a world cut off from God. What happens in the story of the Bible? The people are placed outside the garden... To have to go against the tide. Life becomes hard. <coughs> okay. Who did God give authority to on the earth, on the ground? Adam, Adam Naive. Together. Both of them together. God gives them authority. You are made in God's image. You are like God. You will rule over creation. Okay. Did God give Satan authority? No. no. Who gave Satan authority? Adam and Eve. Adam and Eve, by eating from this tree, they gave Satan authority. And so, that means, who's got the authority on earth? Yeah. Only because he tricked the people to listen to him. And every time we listen to the enemy, we give authority to him. Okay? If we listen to the enemy, we give authority, and we do his will. Okay, this is all... Okay? Let's read. I want, I want to, there's two things I want to do here. How do we have the life of God? How do we have the life of God? 
Because we're cut off from the tree of life. What does God do to provide his life to us again? What do you make you want him to make your road blow? You make him go back and long God. Make him his life long God. Okay. So there's another tree. What does that other tree look like? The tree of life now looks like what? <laughs> New blood tree belong life. Jesus says, come to me so you can have life. So in the, in the garden, they could have life by eating from that tree. Presence of God. We can now have life by, by eating from the tree, this tree. The cross. The bread and the wine we remember. We remember his life. His life becomes our life. Okay. New blood tree. Now I want to talk about, let's go to Ephesians chapter 6. Ephesians chapter 6. Verse 10, 11, and 12. Start reading verse 10, you go to 12. Ephesus chapter 6, verse 10, you go to 12. <coughs> One reply in the reading. Ephesus chapter 6, verse 10, you go to 12. <laughs> Okay, so it talks about all of these spirits that are the enemy, okay? <coughs> now, this is a verse that we talked about, all head spirit, you may talk about, and now we're German in the blood of the garden. Okay, so these spirits exist. Now, Bible, let me talk to you, you may yes, you got all spirit, don't go this stuff. Okay. <coughs> Did God put those spirits there? You think God put him on the spirit of the Salaha? Huh? Yeah, it's, I think he did. There's something about the world. Let's now look at uh, the book of Daniel. Give me a little book of Daniel. Chapter blood Daniel way. Daniel been praying and one plan to come up long in that story long in the body of Sandy passing on passing prayer blood Daniel logo straight. Daniel only chapter. Twelve. 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 Twelve.
Okay, have a look, um, Daniel. Daniel chapter 10, verse 20. Daniel chapter 10, verse 20. <coughs> Daniel 10, 20. Mais ami Tokol Sem. Vous savez, vous savez, mi kam long yo. Mi kam long out in clear sample talk, only bin, writing long book, belong talk through. That's why me no can stop long la time. By me, must go back area up na pipe, long angel is savé look out in country, Persia, Persia. The time this club fight he finish, Angeli look out in country Greek by he come up. Okay, so it says, it talks about an angel over the country of this or that. So an angel over the country of Persia, another angel over the country of Greece. Did you get that? Yeah. I think God has placed spirits with authority over the earth, but they're fallen. Just like Satan is fallen, these spirits have fallen, so they don't do the will of God. So I'm going to draw here. You call him uh, Head Spirit? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so if we look at the Bible, we see spirits over countries and places. Okay? God placed them there for good, but they have become corrupted. And they bring darkness to the peoples. Does that make sense? Good blah? Okay. Now, how does God overcome those spirits? In Ephesians 6, where did it locate those spirits? Where are they? On top? On top. So up here. Now, here's the question. Are they at the same level as God? No. 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 no, okay. So, let's put the head spirit here, okay? Here. In the garden, God had a relationship with Adam and Eve. He could fellowship with them. But something happened. Darkness came and they were cut off from God. That makes sense? Yes. Okay, so they were separated from God. Okay. Now, head spirit... They rule the nations and they bring darkness and evil things. Mm. And they influence the culture yeah. of the world mm. to practice sinful things. Mm. Okay, they bring darkness <sighs> over the earth. Uh, human sin does that, mm. but they're influenced by head spirit. Mm. Okay, bringing darkness over the nations. How does God overcome this? And I think the way that God overcomes this helps us to see, it's like breaking the code and finding out what the strategy is. I'm clear. Okay, so let's go to Ephesians chapter 1. Ephesians chapter 1. Okay, so God... Why does God send Jesus? Long when God is telling Jesus to come down. How does God feel towards the world and towards its people? When God is looking at the ground, you mean all man me and me feel him also when I'm the bell Okay, because of sin in a good place, but because of God's heart. Okay. So like God, he like him uh, man married to us. Okay, John 3.16. God, out of love, sends his son to bring salvation. Okay? 
So now, if let's talk about what happens with Jesus. So Ephesus 1. Verse 18. <clears throat> Ephesus 1.18. 1 um, plus 1 18, Ephesus chapter 1, verse 18, read it. Me like by M he giving light long thinking long upla. By upla he can serve a good law on this the something M he sing out in upla belong kissing. M all something upla he waiting is sharp. Also now by youpla is have long all this la good la good la something God he been marking long youpla sorry God he been marking long you me all man Mary belong M. Okay, and the next verse, keep going. Read him another verse. I don't need long M. Now by youpla he kiss him save all same. This is strong belong God all time he walk long. Help him, you me, old man, Mary, he believe long end. And he be plan more, more. And he be plan more, more yet. You me no enough to long scale him strong belong end. Now this not be plan strong belong God. Mm. This have a walk long, you me. Okay, and again, next one. And that's all before been walk long Christ. Mm. Christ he died finish. Now long this not be plan strong belong God. God he kill up him M now he bring him M he goes in down long hand suit <coughs> long M long heaven. Okay. So Jesus came, and he died on the cross, and then he was buried in a tomb. What happened after that? <coughs> Raised to life. Kira back. And then what happened? Went up to heaven. He went up to heaven. Okay. Jesus goes up to heaven. Where is Jesus? In heaven with who? Is Jesus above the head spirit? Yes. Okay, let's read the next verse. Read the next verse. <laughs> this is where it says he is above. Verse 21. Okay, where is Jesus above the head spirit? <laughs> on top. On top or head spirit or government thing. You, what does that say? So the, the point of this verse is to say that Jesus came down from heaven to bring salvation to people. He died, he was buried, Kira Beck, and he go on top. One time God uh, inside heaven. Far above, above all of this. Okay. I just want to get that clear. Jesus is with God above all other authorities. Do we believe that? Okay. Now, let me tell you about a story of a young man who I grew up with. I'm about giving you a mystery. You just go ahead. A story. Young plumman. Me, uh, 10 play year. This plumman, 10 play year. Uh, uh, one time together in school. Okay? This plumman, me, me long plumman. This plumman, long plumman. Uh, 12 play year, 6 foot tall. I'm in total Christmas, I'm 6 foot tall. Now, big play man. Okay, long play man. Long play Me man. here, this play man here. Okay, long play man. When he was 11 years old, he comes to high school. Uh, you know, uh, uh, year, year 7. Year 7 at school. He comes to school, and the older boys, they see this young, tall man, and what do they want to do? Fight. Bite him. <laughs> so this tall young man, and they say, we can punch him. We're big pla, older. We can uh, punch this young pla, tall pla man, long pla man. Okay, so every day at school for the first few weeks, 
an older boy came to this young plant, long plant man, and says, me bite him you. <laughs> me bite him you. And they started a fight. Guess who won? Long plant man. Why did he win? Punch him down. <laughs> Punch him down on top. He come down like this. He won every fight. <laughs> Long play man. <coughs> Punching down. Okay, Narapella story. One play village. One per village. Um, one per village underneath the mount, La Mountain, okay? Big play village underneath the mountain. Narapella village on top of the mountain. Now there was a, a fight between the two villages. This was a bigger village. Uh, but this village. They had an argument. And so the, the young men in this village said, we're going to fight them. And the, and the village on top of the mountain said, yes, we're going to fight back. <laughs> so the young plant men, he come and they fight. So one plant village here, no plant village here. He fight him, fight. Who's going to win? <laughs> on top of the mountain even though they had less warriors they won the battle because they used the advantage of the height punch him 